tonight. Fear and anger after a popular convenience store owner was shot in the face during a robbery. Awful story. Only News 5 is hearing from a neighbor who helped the victim and is hoping to see some justice served. News 5 Bob Jones is live at the Akron Police Department tonight. And Bob, no doubt this was a brutal attack. Well, Frank, not only was he shot in the face, he was also pistol whipped and stabbed. Tonight, he is in the intensive care unit at an Akron hospital, and co-workers are worried that someone will get hurt if the gunman isn't locked up. Is it worth $100 to shoot someone? A bandage around his head, his eye swollen shut after a bullet went through the face of 34-year-old Will Goodwin, the end result of a robbery at his store, Pioneer Market in Akron, just after midnight Wednesday. Will took off and tried running and and uh, was actually hit by one of the bullets where it came in through the back of his ear and came out through his cheek. Will's co-worker Jim Pito says Will approached a man who was acting strangely inside the carryout when suddenly the man lunged at Will with knives. I swung one of the knives and stabbed Will in the lower abdomen by his, uh, in, in his lower back. Will grabbed a gun from behind the counter, but the intruder wrestled it away, pistol whipped Will, then fired two shots at the owner. One bullet shattered a game of chance machine. Another hit Will's face and shattered the front door. I saw Will, the convenience store owner, crossing the street in front of his store screaming help. So I ran down and I was like, what's going on? And he said, I got shot. Neighbor Matt Coughlin grabbed towels to stop the bleeding and helped Will to his front porch. I think as a human being, like, it's one of the worst situations you can be in. Matt says before the gunman took off, he fired one more shot, perhaps a warning to stay away. He was wearing all black with a black hood and a black backpack, but I didn't get a good look at him. Co-workers say Will is always kind to his customers, been in the community for nine years, and can't comprehend why anyone would nearly kill him. He's very fortunate that he's alive. I mean, one inch, one inch to the right, and it, it would have gone through his brain. Despite Will's serious injuries, police say his condition is not life threatening. Tonight, Summit County Crime Stoppers is offering a reward up to $5,000 for information leading to the gunman. Live in Akron tonight, Bob Jones, News 5. All right, Bob, you got to